In this video, I am going to talk about Thrust Affiliates plugin. It has 30,000 plus active installations as of now. Hi, my name is Pankaj Solanki and I am a WordPress developer from Creative Protein. So let's add this plugin. Uh, there are two plugins that do similar work, Pretty Links and Thrust Affiliates. We will talk about Pretty Links in another tutorial. Let's install it. Let's activate it. So let me show you why would you use Thrusty Affiliates plugin, okay? The first reason is visitors don't want to click on spammy links. Let me give you an example. We are on the WP Beginner website, okay? Uh, they have deals here. Let's go to Blue Host Coupon. If I copy this link, you will note that it is very clean. WP Beginner refers to Blue Host, okay? But if I actually open this link, this link is massive. So no one wants to click on a link like this. This looks very spammy. You know, there are viruses and things like that. So Thrusty Affiliate plugin makes links clean. Second benefit is you won't have to change links at several places. For example, if WP Beginner has used the same link on 1000 pages, they can easily go to Thrusty Affiliate settings and change their link. So they won't have to change the link at several places. Third benefit is you can no follow all affiliate links by default so that the link juice does not pass to the blue host. Fourth benefit is you can open all affiliate links in new window. See here. If I click here, it opens in a new window so that WP beginner page is still open. And if you have Amazon affiliate stores, this plugin is very, very useful. You can manage all your affiliate links at one place. So let's jump to the plugin page. I can directly click here affiliate links. There is no link, so let's add one. Title can be anything. I'll just directly go with blue host, okay? Let's use this link only. And I can just use save link. It has given me local host A recommends blue host. Very clean link. I can easily edit it here. Okay, uh, let's go to the affiliate links again. So it has title link id redirect type is global we will talk about it again in the settings the cloaked url is this the actual destination is this and category is uncategorized okay so let's go to the categories page for example i can use a domain registrar category i can use a hosting category so like this i can just categorize my affiliate links good so far now let's say I can add hosting category to this link. Okay, let's go to the settings now. We have talked about affiliate links and categories. Let's talk about settings now. On the main settings page, you don't have to change anything. Let's go to the appearance page. So if you check here, this link has refer keyword. Okay, you can change this keyword here. A lot of options are given. Recommends is okay for now. In this option, we can also set so that link category also comes in the link. This way, if I have two links with blue host category, they can be different. This is very useful because if I have two links for same blue host, let's use this and I can use domain registrar. Right now it is saying blue host 2 because in the slug I can only use recommends but if I use settings and choose category links also and save then I can easily use recommends hosting blue host and recommends domain register blue host now I can again use blue host see the magic it did not change but I can easily do this. So by default links will have recommends keyword. I can change it from here. A lot of options are given. If I click on this, it will also add category in the link. Very useful. JavaScript redirect is optional, but it should be enabled so that statistics can be tracked. And if a redirect does not work, it can use JavaScript redirect method. Link redirect type should be 301 permanent. You should no follow all links. Yes, you should open all links in new window and save changes you don't have to change anything here you can also import export your settings here let's go to the import csv so if you already have a list of links you can directly import here it is only available in pro version and if you want to export your links you can directly export from here 
let's use amazon import feature so if you have amazon affiliate store very useful feature for your store and it also offers event notifications that for example if 50 links are clicked within 24 hours then just email me things like that and it has reports feature how many links were clicked in last seven days which link was clicked things like that let's talk about pro features as you might have seen import export and amazon settings are in pro version only the two features that i really liked about this plugin is first of them is automatic keyword linking for example I have added a blue host word okay so if i want i can link all blue host word to this link automatically very useful feature and similarly if i have amazon affiliate store and i want to redirect people to different links then i can have one for india one for usa one for uk things like that and it will check ip address ip location and redirect accordingly very useful feature and actually wp beginner is using this plugin thrusty affiliates so this is how you use Thrusty Affiliates plugin. Now that the tutorial is over, I have a question for you. Do you want to use Thrusty Affiliates plugin in your website? You can book a call here and we will help you in setting up the plugin for free. You can also submit your website for our 75 step site audit. It covers speed, security, SEO, conversion, design, etc. Thank you and I'll see you in my next video.